Hey yo, Mike, what we got? Another one. What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, the Retro Wiz Kid, the Shoeologist. And I'm rocking with my mans. The twin. What's good, man? And y'all already know we in the sneaker dungeon, y'all. So yeah. today, as my man said, MJ told y'all, we got another one. Exactly. So what are we going to be talking about today, twin? Man, we're going to talk about these Emerald Jordan 11 lows. I think when they come when they come out, they coming out next Saturday or Sunday. I gotta double check the release date. Well, I'm pretty sure you can throw them on the screen somewhere. I'm gonna throw it <laughs> right here. Is where you're gonna see the official date, y'all. Right here yeah. is the official date. But uh, pick these bad boys up a little bit early. You know what I'm saying? As you see, I got a little bit earlier than the last one, and a little bit earlier than the last one. So. These right here, man, fire, man. Let's let's just start off with the box. You, they could have did better with this box. Yeah, I think so too. They could have did a little bit better, especially the Jordan Eleven, and you had a theme on it, a little bit, you know, Easter theme. Easter but, theme. And I mean, hey, if Jordan want to do that, and I mean, it's not like y'all paying, y'all already making all this money. Y'all keep making all these retros, and we keep buying them. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. so it's like, give us something better, y'all. Y'all could have gave us something better with this one. So. Um, but it's the white, black, emerald rise. So that's the color. That's the color um, scheme of the shoes. Now we both we already got the shoes out the box. Yeah, you already know what time look. it is. My man's twins Boom. about to show you what we talking about. Now, at first glance on this shoe, if I seen this shoe from a distance, I would swear they somebody had on the Concord lows. Yeah. Now. Starting from the bottom of the shoe, I guess. I think that's what you're talking about right here. You can see it a little bit, I guess. Like the black, how black it looks. But then sometimes when I get a little closer, you can tell like... You can tell that that color that color scheme is is crazy on it, man. It reminds me of the All-Stars. You know, it's a all, this should have been an All-Star 11 instead of the Easter 11. Actually, should have released, if you th think about it, should have released last year. So. Yeah, yeah. With instead the, of releasing them sixes... That's your least these. You should have came out with these, JB. Now, one thing, like I said, from a distance you see that, but starting from the bottom, bro. Yeah. The bottom. This I want to say that's the best feature, hand down. Best, bro. Look at this, y'all. This is not the milky bottom. It's not the icy bottom. It has the bottom. I believe the All Star Sixes had this bottom, didn't it? Yeah, but the ones he was just talking about the ones. Not on one. You don't wore it, but <laughs> you wore the things. Well, <laughs> hey, well, you, you get the idea. You get the idea. You get the idea. I don't want You wear shoes, but you get the idea. Like you can see the little middle right here. Can you pull them back up? You know what I'm saying? You get the idea. Even if you even if you put it right there on the shoe, you can kind of see it a little bit. Yeah. So. These are going to turn, uh, but I ain't putting no sole protectors on these, to be honest, uh, or nothing like that. But starting off at the bottom, you got that crazy color, like I said. And then when you're working your way up. Now, one of the biggest distinct things on this shoe, other than how the color changes from that greenish, sometimes it look black to me, sometimes it look blue, just the crazy flip-flop candy paint like what you see in Texas and stuff. When we take this shoe horn out... And we just gonna talk about this toe box. I ain't never seen no toe box like this on no 11. <laughs> Look at this junk, y'all. Y'all see that? <laughs> y'all see that? That junk mushy. Now I don't know if that's the material that they used on it, and I haven't put the foot hey. shoe on foot, but y'all know I'm gonna run it on foot. But so that's a shoe like if you buy this shoe off somebody and you don't get it like from a regular, you know, what I mean retail store. You gonna think them face? Yeah, it's like you get it in. You like this look a little too soft, man. Hold on, let let let's let's pull out another eleven. So these right here, you got your UNC eleven lows, Carolinas. Look at this. We compare them. So you squeeze that one, boy. Hey, squeeze the top one. There you go. Look, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know. So I know Unbreakable Kicks and Measly G. They um 
did a review on it. They just said that's how good the quality leather is. But I won't say you put pad leather on it anyway. Anyway, like I'm trying to figure out, do I need to ride sneaker shields with it? But uh, that is pretty nice, though. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Actually, yeah. Which one? This one. Yeah. The upper, the upper on these is plush. It's it's better than all the lows that have dropped recently, especially right here, close up, showing y'all how these look. Now, when you, I can see some. Hey, so you see how tumble that is? The uh, the tongue flat. Now this is giving so y'all a comparison get, yeah. of the lows on the lows how they look. You get your money worth out of this shoe. Now, um, on the back, you got you got the jump man like what you regular have, and, but then you got the twenty three in that off like greenish kind of yeah. like a mint. I I don't know how to describe the color, but it's it's an offset green. And the inside, I believe, as well on the jump man, and the inside is the same as well inside of there. You know, what I always thought weird about with Jordan um, eleven lows. Let me, let me see what that shit. I is. feel like yes, sometimes they could have just not put the little jump man on there. Yeah, like this match, they this match that was all white and they didn't have a jump man on there. I think it's, she would still be dope. You don't even really need it. This jump man, but you know what? This jump man be looking better than some of the big jump mans on the <laughs> He he he's like perfectly shaped. Some I think because he's so small. Yeah, but you got that hit right there on the inside with the same color that you got on the twenty three. Man, dope thing, man. It's a, it's a dope shoe. It like, is, man. I really I think they had this in a vault though, man, because. I really think this theme would have been best with last year's theme. Last all star year. theme. Showing them all star ones again, bro. Like just looking at these all star ones with these side by side, y'all. Look at that. Say that this does not like look at the tips right here and everything. The tips, everything goes with this colorway, man. Y'all see that? Everything goes with it, man. From from this part all the way around to like on the toe box right here. When you yeah. look at the toe boxes, the toe boxes and everything. I'm trying to give y'all like the little shimmer so y'all can see it. Change Ooh, it just change. thought of something. That'd have been a dope pack. Dope pack. Say y'all wouldn't have bought those All Star Weekend last year. Jordan bring y'all slipping. Y'all should have dropped these so all star weekend in the pack. Y'all could have easily <laughs> did this for three hundred dollars. And 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 Lord Lord knows if they had to did these in highs, psh, pack would have. If they would have done this in highs, hey, they would have kept that shoe. This shoe was dope to me, but, but a lot of people would have been like, ah, trash, huh? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Y'all would have been, would've been the champion if y'all had to did this. Exactly. With the highs with that. I'm about to up the champion bill. Nah, bro, you all good. <laughs> but yeah, man, you know, good good little carbon fiber back down there as as usual. Nothing really different other than the fact that they went better with the quality on the upper up here. A lot the better. White. A lot, lot better. better. Tumbling it a little bit. Got a, It feels more luxurious than this. This one looks a little bit cheaper. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But when you look at them side by side like that, dope. And that's also that's always a good sign too. That's telling you that Jordan, Jordan brand, is evolving. Yep, they actually getting like everybody said they want good quality remastered. It's showing you it's remastered. This shoe shows you it's remastered. The it's a nice shoe. I don't know this remastered, bro. It's a damn toe box, bro. That might, that <laughs> might be the good quality. <laughs> but that might be this might be the good quality. We don't know about because you know sometimes you know you wear Elevens that should be stiff. I guess now because when I when I do the on foot. But and I wonder how it's going to age like when you put it on your foot. Like, it's going to crease Is it going to crease? Yeah. That's the big question. Because right now, that shit is bouncing back like elastic. That's not just bouncing back for you. But And I ain't never seen it. If a leather get too much crease, it ain't going to look good. So, this man, you walk around with shit look like this. Yeah, bro. Oh, God. It's like, you just been standing on your tippy toes. <laughs> crucifying your shoes. But, yeah, man. that's now, Overall, man. Jordan Brady did anything. I like it. I like, I like it, too. it, You know what I'm saying? Not bad at all. I wonder, is this a cop? Or is this a drop? And y'all get y'all opinion in the uh, comment section. What y'all think? Is it a cop or a drop? What you think, twin? Man, I think it's a cop, man. I it's think, a dope. I think it's a dope summer shoe. Dope concept. Yup. Um, something you can slide on if you just want to just... I don't really wear shorts, but that's something you want to just throw on some shorts with. Just go outside, nice sunny day. Just let the sun hit off on the shoe. Take a dope photo or something for yeah. the IG. You already know, y'all. Follow your boy on Instagram at the Retro Wiz Kid. I had to pick. I had to put that in there. Of course, uh, sure. Of course, ain't no wrong with that. But yeah, bro, I think it's a dope. Yeah, it I, is. I think it's a dope cop for 2018. So, yeah, man. A lot of people might sleep on them though. 
I don't know. Nah, I don't know how Jordan's been doing lately, man. I think it's gonna sell out. People still got tax money. It's definitely selling out. So uh, I don't know though, cause tax season a little, little pass. So now all them tax yeah, heads, you still they got done. the you still got the Jordan ones releasing this weekend or yep. tomorrow. Yep. Yep. And then, and then you Sean also... Sean Witherspoon, 97s, yeah. Tinker 3s. Yeah, bro, you got a lot of stuff Then you out still tomorrow. got in April, the, the beginning of April, you got the Shadow 1. So, yeah. I don't know, tax you might... tax money might be gone, y'all, if y'all been using... All y'all tax Jordan buyers and sneaker buyers. Exactly. I appreciate y'all tax money almost being gone. So, now it's really going to see what a market at, too. Not trying to get all schedule, but now it's going to see what the... What the market's, the market's really is. looking like. Yeah, a lot everything of people, is selling out... But you can really see how stuff is. It is, especially over summertime, man. Good thing for me, though. You know, I don't need no tax money. No, no. <laughs> no, no. We don't live like that. It's, it's good to have it. I ain't trying to say no wrong. It's good to have it. But you can't expect to live off of it for life. Exactly. But, uh, yeah, man. I mean, that's pretty much it. I'm going to spend them pictures like always for y'all. I appreciate you coming through, twin, to do this with your boy. Man, anytime, man. When you said you had these, I had to go look them in hand. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, you know what I'm saying? Hit that subscribe button. Yeah. Go ahead and join the Dungeon family. We on the road to 250 subscribers. Follow your yeah. boy on Instagram at the Retro Wiz Kid. And I think I should get on some on feet on these. Yeah, why not? All right, y'all. So, y'all already know what time it is. We're going to spin these pictures, and I'm going to hit y'all with this on foot. Let's get it.